Sheen and Ben's behalf, I'd like to welcome all of you here to Stella this afternoon with this important do, not simply for them, but also for your families. For all of us, it is a time to reflect on the past, but also, too, to look to the future with them, praying with them and for them that their married life will be strong and vibrant, and they will truly find in each other their other half, the fulfilment of their hopes, their life's desire. hard to put into words how much I genuinely love the girl. Um, it's been around 10 years that we've met since we've met now and we've had so many experiences together. We've seen to have been everywhere and, ev and done everything together. I think mean, you know from going to Dubai, seeing you cry on your first water ride <laughs> or taking you to your first Spurs game and hearing you shout you know what I mean. <laughs> We've got a lot of memories, they're the ones I cherish, but... <laughs> but the biggest has to be, obviously, creating our daughter Rose, who is just as beautiful as her mother, just as clever, just as sassy. But during the pregnancy, you know, I, I, don't, I think I took it a little bit for granted, but now looking back on it, I think she was a real trooper. I'm a real soldier. I'm very... I know you females make a lot of the process, but... I'm joking, where's the white towel? No, but seriously, she went through the labour without any pain relief, and I've never been so proud of someone in my life. I really was proud of you. And at the end of it, she's obviously been the best mother anyone could be, and I'll be honest, I thought I was in love with her, but once she had Rose, it went up to there, so... Uh, <laughs> finally, last thing I want to say is I do want to thank you for obviously being my wife and being there for me for everything. Because without you, I think, to be honest, things might be a little bit different and I think I would have struggled with a few things personally. So I do appreciate you and I love you more than anything. <laughs>